Department said they just received a $3 million endowment. Our Clancy Burke is there right now to explain why this is such a big deal for students from around the country. Good morning, Clancy. Hey, John. Economics is kind of an intimidating word. I mean, I remember going into my very first economics class thinking I was going to be learning an entirely new language, but that wasn't the case. Economics is all around us, and this donation is going to help the UC Economics Center bring it into the classroom. Specifically, they work with students K through 12, and you might be thinking, what could a kindergartner possibly learn? And the answer is everything. Kids' spending patterns are set in early age, so it's essential to teach them how to be thoughtful about their decisions, not jump in into a decision to weigh the pros, weigh the cons, the benefits, and mostly we're focusing on not just a big list of vocabulary words, but what they mean, how they can be applied to the real world at an early age. Waiting until high school is waiting way too late. Way too, we don't wait until high school to teach anything else. We don't wait until kids are a senior, a senior in high school and go, oh, you know, maybe it's time we, we taught them some math. And this $3 million endowment, I'll say that again, $3 million was given by a man, man named Peter Alpa, and it's going to help with specific programs coming up right here in Local 12 within the next half hour. We'll talk about one that's really cool. For now, though, reporting live at the University of Cincinnati, Clancy Burke, Local 12 News. All right, Clancy, thank you for that. Now, the Economic Center has been renamed the Alpa Family Economic Center in honor of that donation.